arrived. Time to fight Owens' fight. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Championship. Making his way to the ring from Marieville, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 266 pounds, Kevin Owens. Throughout his career, KO has let it be known he will fight anyone, anywhere. Truly, Kevin Owens has no hint of fear in his being. Now here's someone ready to storm into a fight. First one to enter, last one to leave. And his opponent from Los Angeles, California, weighing in at 241 pounds, L.A. Knight. L.A. Knight's not a fad. He has proven himself to be legit. He's trending because his star is white hot. There's no doubt LA Knight has created something special with the WWE Universe. It's a real movement with everybody saying his name. Now it becomes about what can Knight do with it. A title coveted by legends and hungry young talent alike. That's the bell and the fight is on. Kevin Owens enters this match with a chip on his shoulder and a short fuse. KO's love of fighting and inflicting pain on others means his attacks come from every direction. He pulverizes you on the ground and can even take to the skies. Owens is an emotional man and a defiant competitor. KO brings the fight immediately and he doesn't stop until he decides to stop. And he's got his hands full in this matchup against the one and only L.A. Knight. Catchphrases aside, I have to give it tonight. This is a man who had his eyes set on the top of the mountain, and despite a few missteps and setbacks along that climb, he has finally made it to the summit. It's going to be hard to knock LA Knight off that perch. Completely steamrolled. A oh, double knee face breaker. Caught him with a big boot. On the mark. A oh, costly error there. Oh. Stomp to the guts. Oh, an insult to injury. And he's able to reverse. Into the neck breaker. Oh, my goodness. Ah, what a smash! That is just insulting. And LA Knight says it's his game, but what do you do to make it your game against him, Corey? If you give LA Knight an inch, he'll take a mile, so don't give him an inch. Knight runs on confidence, so if you get out front early, you might keep him from gaining the upper hand. Big time power slam! Goes into the pin. You have to think this battle is starting to weigh down on him. Ah, striking with an A. He's getting a little battered now. Yeah, that right there was Knight's smash mouth style we always talk about. Caught in a bad position here. Piercing the throat. Drops the knee. 
Owens running into some trouble. Owens needs to find an opening. Stirring back to his feet, but he might not know where he is. From the top, double axe handle. Look at this, got their opponent pinned down, and now... Owens gets control. And finds a counter. Takedown, went over the cross face, it's cinched in, this could be up. We're gonna free the arm and does just that. Getting set up for something in the corner, and he saw that coming from Knight. Oh my goodness. Back is powerbomb. Here's a pin for the title. Squeeze that shoulder out. So close. KO lining it up. Could be just moments. Uh-oh. As with a situation for LA Knight. Is it enough? The cover. Two count. One. A kick out. I don't believe it. I do not know how you survive that. Staying alive there is unheard of. Owens has ended so many matches with that, but not today. Able to elude it. Oh, that's a that's a line. It's cinched in. This could be over. I'm not quite sure if this man shouldn't tap at. We're going to free the arm and does just that. And this might not have a pleasant ending. Snake out. Head attack for the championship. I cannot believe what I'm seeing right now. No one can. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Oh, read right him there. Hey! Not much fight left in KO, it seems. LA Knight kick to the gut. BFT! Knight about to end this fight. Just powering out of that pinfall. This match is far from over. And it may just take going to the well one more time with that maneuver to gain the pinfall. Uses the edge of the knee. Yeah. And all eyes are on Knight now. Striking with the knee drop. So precise. Fight is so close to our announce table. Yeah, I'm just going to step aside now. Hey, wait for me. Double axe handle. And Knight's firmly in command. Knight has his opponent figured out. And now thrown back into the ring. The cockiness of LA Knight, not even considering taking this seriously. Gloating for the world to see. Superstar giving an inch here. Boom. Two Titans trading strikes and refusing to back down. WWE Universe appreciating these athletes going all out. Toe to toe, treating each other like heavy bags. Both absolutely drained, but both refusing to give up. An impactful attack. LA Knight. LA Knight with the BFT. Oh, is in some serious trouble. And we have a new champion. Unbelievable. Here is your winner. And new WWE Champion, LA Knight. Truly a huge win for this superstar, or should I say, for the new champion. We really are looking at a new era, Cole. Soak it in.
talking. The following contest is a triple threat tag team match and is for the MCW Tag Team Championship. Introducing the champion from New York, New York, weighing in at 275 pounds, one half of the FCW Tag Team Champions. Here we go, gentlemen. Huge title match coming up and a huge opportunity for the champ to prove to everyone that there truly is none better in all of WWE right now. The WWE Universe more than ready for this title defense and the champion is prepared too. Oh, yeah, I am pumped for this guy. champ's chances here tonight. I love him. I'm not like everybody else, Cole. It seems like everybody's ready to write the champ's demise, but not me. The pressures of being champion are very real, but this guy is ready for it.
We are about to see something good. And from Helena, Montana, weighing in at 240 pounds, Ace the Freak Campbell. It's a big time opportunity, Byron, as the title will be on the line here. You're right, Michael. And judging from the response on social media heading into this match, we're likely to see a new champ crowned here tonight. This is a man who makes the most of every opportunity, and this is his biggest opportunity ever. And here comes one of our favorites. And from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 230 pounds. Remember, guys, the title is on the line here in this one. And I don't remember the last time the champ was in this much jeopardy, Cole. Tonight might just be the night the title changes hands. Take a look in his eyes, more than ready to become the standard bearer of this division. All right, I love this guy. And from Georgia, weighing in at 289 pounds. It's a big-time opportunity, Byron, as the title will be on the line here. You're right, Michael. And judging from the response on social media heading into this match, we're likely to see a new champ crowned here tonight. He's got a good chance of becoming the new champion tonight, and the WWE Universe is buzzing about it. The WWE Universe just exploded! And 
from Michigan, weighing in at 225 pounds. E I Justin. Remember, guys, the title is on the line here in this one. And I don't remember the last time the champ was in this much jeopardy, Cole. Tonight might just be the night the title changes hands. The challenger about to compete in a career-altering championship match. He is ready. Multiple teams facing off in this Tornado Tag match. In a Tornado Tag situation, you never know how many opponents will be talking to you. The only one on your side is your tag team partner. The oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Oh, what a giddy team. Wow. Ooh, well measured. Oh, my God. Dang. My God. Enough. Byron and Mac. Here's the pin title on the line. And he stops the count. Taking their share of hits now. And some effective offense with that one. Totally derailing the ch cover by the challenger. The champ lifts his shoulder up before one there. Staying in this one. Going for a pin for the championship. That could have been it right there. Ooh.
take down of their opponent, and there it is, the figure. Trying to find a way out. The pressure is reversed. This is agonizing. Oh, oh, oh just got hit by him. Now the pen for the championship. And the count's broken, keeping the match alive. It's not over yet. Whoa! Somersault plancha! Just a devil may care attitude on full display. Going for broke and it pays off. Cover for the championship! No kick out at two! How in the world did he kick out? Boom right the button! Has them hooked! Over. Here it comes! He touches! Here's the pin title on the line! The champ taking an immense amount of damage! And he has just taken an extraordinary amount of abuse. Jumpers down! Must be kept on. DDT! Oh! Oh, a horrific crack in the back. Just a ghastly shot. And he breaks up the count. That slam with some attitude. to the kidneys from behind. Oh, the whole man. And there's some force on that move. Haymaker connects. Effective arm drag. Still gonna take a massive effort to keep him down. What a beautiful moonsault. showing by this tag team. After that win, this superstar stock is rising, and they are dancing all the way to the pay window. The following contest 
is scheduled for one fall and is for the United States Championship. The arrogant social media star is here. Well, love him or hate him, his career is off to an amazing start. You're right, Saxton. This guy nearly ended the 800-plus day universal title reign of Roman Reigns in just his third match. This man has got to be clear-minded and completely focused for the threat that is Finn Balor. Finn Balor has arrived. Say hello to the Prince of Judgment. You know, Finn Balor used to have such a deep connection with the WWE Universe, but he's thrown all that away with this new attitude. I'd argue that was the smartest thing that Balor's ever done. Finn used to be the guy who let glory slip through his fingers, who fell just short of expectations, but now he's living up to his hype and much more. Balor famously became the first ever Universal Champion, but had to surrender the title to injury. And he's had some measure of success since then, but he's become bitter, he's become jaded. Uh, you speak lies, Cole. Finn Balor simply realigned his values. He knows now what he must do to return to the mountaintop, and he's more prepared to do so. Looking at the champion, I guarantee there is no doubt in their mind as to who is leaving this match with the title around their waist. the championship on the line a champion on high alert ladies and gentlemen we're in store for something special what a hot shot sent all the way to the outside and count outs are legal so hopefully this will be a short trip outside oh god 
Ah. Uh, a forearm all across the face. And any one of those shots could take you out for good. Finn Balor, one of the most educated superstars on our roster. Is there any specific key to taking him down? You can't hope to match the kind of experience Finn Balor has. But with that longevity comes exposed weaknesses. Identify the weak spots and target them accordingly. Because if he takes you into the deep water, you will drown. In the corner. Doling out as much damage as possible. Looking to silence the challenger once and for all. Uh-oh. Somersault plancha to the floor. That is reckless abandon being shown. And paying off as well. Connecting with a sharp elbow. Thrown back in under the ropes. Oof, and all the impact brought to the knee. Challenger's a little worse for wear now. And with that move, I'd say Balor's ruthlessness will be key to his success. Gets him with the counter. Oh, Finn Balor with the overhead kick. He saw that one coming. Vicious right forearm. Staved off that attack. Oh, he's got him where he wants him. Here we go. What now? Oh, a stop to the belly welly. Paul avoids the attack. Punch connects. He's been placed in the corner now. Oh, man. Oh, targeting the arm. This has got to hurt. The champ getting put to the test here. Yeah, Paul looked like a natural with that one. Not stop blows. Trying to drag their opponent out of the corner. And what are they looking for here? Bent face first into a reverse powerbomb. Does the official not see him removing the turnbuckle pad? Keep your voice down. Vaulting plancha, incredible. Toss caution out the window, and it paid off. Adrenaline is through the roof now. Love him or hate him, you can't deny it. Logan Paul can get it done in the ring. And he gets delivered back into the ring. He avoids the damage. Balor being measured. The end could be near. What a punch just tattooed. We could have a new champion, but the ref isn't even paying attention. Never mind what you're doing. Make the count. Quick shoulder up. This deep into the match, and he's able to kick out before a one count? It's stunning. And I get that Paul thought he had him there, but he really needs to follow up. He can't let time cost him this match. Oh, this is just too far. Get some control in there. And the champion finally ready to put this one away. The challenger stays alive. Kicking out now sends a very clear message. Now, uh, 15, 16. The title's going nowhere. Cover. Kiss your dreams. Good night. Oh, kick out, kick out at two. Simply refusing to let this opportunity slip away. And who knows if there'll be another shot, yet you can't give up now. And now's the time where Finn needs to keep the pedal to the metal, sustain his offense. Ooh. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. And Paul is being picked apart here. Finn is from the top. Of their body. The challenger is in some big trouble. Yeah, this match has not been kind to him. Momentum shifts to Paul's corner. That could be the spark Logan Paul was looking for. Burst of strikes. Mistake made by Logan Paul. Ballard's got him hooked. Up and... This match is getting pushed beyond the normal limits. Oh, he's been waiting for it the whole time. Stopping the ref's count at two. I am in 
shock. What's it going to take to keep this guy down? A forearm all across the face. These men have been giving each other such a beating. And you can see the toll of that beating taking effect with every movement. Uh-oh. Well placed, elbow to the leg. And Finn heads him off at the pass. Able to get the advantage here. Here is your winner, and still, United States Champion, Finn Balor! A successful title defense for him tonight. Statement made. He wants everyone to know this is his title. Here comes our Tribal Chief. Perhaps the most dominant champion in WWE history. The head of the table, Roman Reigns. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing the Bloodline from Pensacola, Florida. Weighing in at 265 pounds, Roman. I've been at this table for decades, and I've never seen a competitor this dominant. Month in, month out, Reigns continues to dominate. Yeah, but think about this, Corey. The man who finally puts a loss in Roman's record will become immortal. It's bold of you to think he'll even lose. Well, even with the competition at this level, you might be right. The one thing you have to do is prevent Rollins from that ruthless assault. You're right, but it's much easier said than done when you consider the multifaceted offensive attack of Seth freaking Rollins. Here's someone who always has a plan and always knows who he's dealing with. It's Seth freaking Rollins. Think of everything Seth Rollins has been through. Everything he's accomplished, he can adapt to any situation. And his opponent from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 217 pounds, Seth. A decade of being WWE's freaking workhorse, and the WWE Universe is finally singing his praises. I don't think any 
Nobody in WWE runs their mouth quite as much as Seth freaking Rollins. Yeah, but nobody delivers on their promises like he does either. These men have a story and at times complicated history. Though they share a brotherhood, Seth Rollins told me today he needs to get back to being the face of WWE. Maybe we'll see a return to his one-time credo of whatever it takes. Rollins and Reigns, Shield brethren. There is always a big fight feel when these two are in the ring. Rollins is looking to reignite his career, but the big dog will never relinquish his yard. That was quite the impact on the apron. You might be in shock now, but you'll be feeling lasting pain for a few weeks to come. Oh, suplex! Launched. the script on him there. into the corner. Dangerous position with your feet tied up like that. Ah, he's got that boot right up against oh, his face. Come on. There was no issue with that attack. Hey, sometimes desperate times come for desperate measures. Who are we to judge? Every strike more devastating than the last. Cover! Only a one count before the kick out. Not even a near fall there. Oh, this is gonna hurt. I got right to the gut. Rollins is known for being a... Wait, 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 wait! Power right out in one. It'll take more than that to hold him down. Oh, it may be time to start burning it down. Rollins is starting to roll. A relentless attack being brought to Roman. Yeah, Rollins is giving Roman Reigns his very best shots. in a second to stay alive there. Uh-oh! Rollins just a step too slow. Tossed. She could airline miles for that. Rollins got caught believing his own hype a bit. Rapid fire Samoan drop. Oh my goodness! Ah, what a smash! That is just insulting. Just disrespectful. Launch out to the outside! That was coming in hot at breakneck speed. Going fast and... Reigns, Reigns with the guillotine! Well, this won't win the match, but it's one way to inflict a great... The guillotine locked in. This is all... That was an incredible counter. Oh, man, meeting the barricade. Setting up neck breaker position. Oh, forearm to the back. Saw that one coming. Whip back into the ring. What a counter by Rollins. Bam! By Reigns! Is there any fight left in Rollins? Cover! Resilience on display from Seth Rollins. How did Rollins kick out? And after
after all that, Roman Reigns still has an end to this battle. That one fails to land. Rollins on the move! Down low with the stop. It is all Rollins now. Shoulders down. Kicks out, just kicked out. The head of the table almost went to the back of the line on that one. Roman better get it together. How often do you see Seth Rollins come up that short, that close? He's got to be livid right about now. Kicks to the face. Capped off with a big one. Rollins making perfectly clear who the visionary is in this match. Drop kick. Oh, right in the back. Lifts their opponent's oh, legs. Oh, oh. And We know what Seth has in store for an old brother here. He turns it around. Uh-oh, it's the red, white, and blue Thunderbomb. He has to be at his limit now. Reigns in the corner, ready to staying in this thing. Some could even say he's far too stubborn to have things end like that. Roman has been denied. This is not something we're used to seeing, and by the looks of things, neither is Reigns. Look at the desire and the determination we're seeing tonight. To win, someone will have to go to lengths they've never gone before. Powerless position to be in right now. Right across the legs. He is still in this. Vicious right forearm. Picture perfect drop kick. Oh, moonsault! Man, did you see the height on that? Top rope, here we go. Up high. Five star frog splash! Consecutive high. Maneuvers and the pace of this match has certainly picked up. You got a question. How much is it worth? How much is it worth to continue through the agony? It's obvious. Rollins looking to end it. Stop! That is what it takes to top a rage. Pin. It is enough. Finally, it's over. Here is your winner. What an incredible moment for Seth Rollins. Tonight, the Beast Slayer fulfilled his destiny and brought his former Shield brother down. Rollins knew he had to stay the course and do whatever it took to defeat Reigns. The smoke is here. Ha <laughs> ha. Party cups in hand. And we're all ready for a good time. And yeah, make no mistake, AD is also ready for a fight. The following contest is a tornado tag team match. And is for the world tag team championship introducing first representing the dudley boys from cincinnati ohio weighing in at 260 pounds angelo Dawkins. oh you know what time it is it has been a long road for angelo dawkins to WWE success from humble NXT beginnings, but he is finally enjoying the fruits of his labor. Oh, you know it's 
time. Get ready to testify. And his partner, representing the Dudley Boys from Dudleyville, weighing in at 269 pounds, Devon Dudley! Tons of tag team goal, but more than ready to fight on his own. Oh, the collection plate is out, and he is ready to punish the sinners. Doesn't matter if he's fighting alone or with his brother, Devon will beat you up all the same. Now, Devon is more than happy to put folks through tables all on his own. Heck, maybe he'll put one of us through one, too. Gentlemen, the bare knuckle brawler is in the house. One of the toughest competitors around, Wade Barrett. And from Preston, England, weighing in at 246 pounds, Wade Barrett. We are witnessing the return of the street tough bare knuckle brawler. A man who can put you down with one bull hammer. Focused and ready to brawl. Just like his time on the streets. Tonight's forecast calls for a strong chance of a real hard-hitting, bone-breaking statement being made tonight. Hey, Michael. It's fight night! You've obviously never, ever been in a fight. Please never do that again, Saxton, for all of our sakes. And from Dublin, Ireland, weighing in at 267 pounds, the Celtic warrior, Seamus! The leader of the brawling brutes. I'll tell you, this guy will fight anyone. Even his friends. Well, it's a good thing Seamus doesn't consider you a friend. Still a lot of fights left in the Celtic Warrior, that's for sure. A pint and a fight is a good Seamus night. My sources say the Celtic Warrior already has a couple cold ones waiting backstage. On the line of the Tag Team Championships, teams in their respective corners going over final strategies. Tag titles on the line here tonight. These teams absolutely have their eyes on the prize in this Tornado Tag Team match. We are kicking this one off with Angelo Dawkins and Devon Dudley. And they'll be in for one hell of a tag team match as they square up with Wade Barrett and Sheamus. He went right into that turnbuckle. Boom for the title. Early kick out. Referee right on top of the action. Kicking out so early certainly sends a message. Counter! And now there's an opening. Swinging neck breaker. Textbook. In full control here. Short punch. Suplex. Oh. Here it comes. Nicely done. Two count. 
channeling his energy to stay in this matchup. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. He's looking a little off balance. Oh, man, inverted backbreaker. Ow. Northern right suplex. Elbow drop. Just stomping right into the face. Oh, Devon got caught with the reversal. Ripcord. Oh, my goodness. Nasty line. Down a perfect vertical suplex. The WWE Universe is pouring more fuel on his fire right now. Boom, running FTO plants him. Nicely done. Lining it up. Punch lands. Really just laying it in. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. He's got the answer for that one. Oh, stomping right onto the arm. He is just <laughs> reeling from that offense. No way. Somersault plunge on the floor. No sign of hesitation. That risk gained big rewards. Ah, with the championship on the line. No. What a moment! Here are your winners, and the new World Tag Team Champions, the team of the Celtic Warrior, Sheamus, and Wayne Barrett! Plenty of chaos in that exciting Tornado Tag Contest. I was barely in my seat for most of this one. This team put on a tremendous show. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the FCW World Championship. Things are about to get good. It's a big fight feel here tonight as the title is on the line. And title matches like this have a way of getting your blood flowing unlike any other match. A lot of pressure on this superstar. Tonight's where he needs to prove that he's championship material.
Gentlemen, it is time to make some money. Well, I'm not sure if his financials are that solid, but the Cameron Grimes stock is rising in the ring. A second generation competitor, Grimes competes every night to honor his father's legacy. Yeah, but make no mistake about it, Cameron Grimes is a self-made man, from his wealth to his in-ring skill. Cameron Grimes is not to be underestimated, and based on his bank statement, not to be undervalued either. Introducing the challenger from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 200 pounds. And his opponent from Burlington, North Carolina, weighing in at 220 pounds, the FCW World Champion, Cameron. The energy in this arena is palpable. These competitors know exactly what's on the line. Here we go with the title on the line. The stakes in this match really couldn't be any higher. Uh, you can tell these superstars are ready to give their all to walk out of here the champion. They might be limping out of here if this match is even yeah. half as intense as I think it might be. Oh, Quick God. strike to the lower body. Floor. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. Oh, driving the elbow. Cameron is in the zone and letting the opposition know it. Stomping down. They're playing ways. Battling in this area could end in serious harm. The challenger is looking shaken. A savage attack befitting the technical savage. And now gets tossed into the ring. He heads outside. Countout's legal in this match. How does one contend with the devastating power of Cameron Grimes? If Grimes gets on a roll offensively, he can quickly overwhelm you. So you have to find ways to disrupt his rhythm and dictate the flow of this match. The more you control the tempo, the more you control Cameron Grimes. Double axe handle. Ooh, carefully measured knee strikes. Oh, with these knee strikes. That was a furious assault from the champion. Each blow coming in harder than the last. Thrown out of ringside and back to the mat. Yeah. Saw that one coming. Springboard Roundhouse. He must have seen that coming. Nice counter from Grimes. Cover by the champ. He narrowly avoids the count. He's still in the fight, but for how much longer? Standing shooting star press. Acrobatics like that take a tremendous amount of cardio and strength. Section. He leaves the ring, but he could lose this match by countout. 
Look at this heel hook. This is how you punish your opponent, and he's enjoying every minute of it. Oh, running elbow drop on target. Whatever's playing here can't be good. Oh, man, taking it to the trachea. The challenger is not in a great place. Yeah, Cole, but at this point in the match, you still haven't lost the edge. With a swinging side effect. Cover! And the champ can't keep the shoulders down. He's still got more left in the tank. Look at Grimes. Top rope. He's reeling, slowly getting up. Take off. We'd see a kick out there. Shifts it back onto him. The champ will have to dig deeper now. And you can see the frustration building inside Cameron Grimes right now. Setting up. All the way out. Suplex. Now a pin for the championship. Strong kick out of two from the champion. And you got to think, he's just one final blow away from not kicking out next time. Absolutely throwing all caution to the wind. Spitting in the face of danger. Oh, that can shatter a jump. Jarring impact. Reversal! What a counter! Sharp knee. And the pressure on ground continues to mount. Smart move here. Looking to disrupt Grimes' rhythm and dictate the flow of this match. And he tosses him back in now. Grimes staggering. Has no idea what's coming. Look at that. Bangleser. Good to see a new champ. The cover. And a kick out. No one saw that. What a display of stamina. The champ showing they are truly worthy of this title. But things might only get harder from here. When your opponent can hang after all that, you're wondering if running a win might just be impossible. He's falling victim here to a charge of attacks. Cameron's going to be reaching for the moonshine after the match if this keeps up. These men have been all gas and no brakes tonight, and they have to be feeling the effects. Well, they have to be running on fumes. I don't know how much longer they can go. The challenger being outclassed here. Look at this. Slingshot sent Tom to the outside. A roll of the dice, and it pays off in full. Talk about dismantling your opponent. Now Cameron Grimes with a swinging side effect. Boy, Grimes just went off like a stick of dynamite. And his opponent took the full force of the blast. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. this. Cameron Grimes has his opponent. There's a small package driver. But champions need to finish the job. That's it. The champ stays the champ. Here is your winner. And still FCW World Champion Cameron Grimes. Crucial victory as he retains the title. He's definitely fought to keep his championship, and that's something he should be really proud of.
The following contest is scheduled for one fall. And is for the Intercontinental Championship. Time for the animal to be unleashed. Batista is in the building. The animal, six foot six, 290 pounds, the personification of unbridled power. Batista has torn through the competition and always gets what he wants. Six foot six, 295 pounds, all animal. We've seen that when the beast is unleashed, nobody can stop Batista. Championships, main events, Batista will take them by force. And gentlemen, tonight the animal is on the hunt for even more. The world's most dangerous man is here. Ken Shamrock's going to knuckle up and get himself some here tonight. Go, go, go! Yeah! <laughs> Shamrock's transition from the MMA world to WWE has been seamless. He treats every match like a cage fight. He's been the world's most dangerous champion as a former Intercontinental Champion, a Tag Team Champion, and King of the Ring. Shamrock's all business. He's not wasting time when it comes to incapacitating an opponent. I don't know who can stop him. Ken Shamrock will do anything that enters his mind to emerge from battle victorious. Introducing the challenger from Washington, D.C., weighing in at 290 pounds, the animal, Batista! And his opponent from Sacramento, California, weighing in at 205 pounds, the Intercontinental Champion, the world's most dangerous man, Kid Shamrock! You can see it in the eyes of each individual. Only razor sharp focus when this much is on the line. The champion came out here somewhat gloating their belt around. Don't know if that's their way of playing mind games. That title should give anyone the right to gloat. Look, what good is it being on top of the mountain if you don't get to look down on everybody else? That is a sad attitude to have. Bam! Down he goes. Shamrock gets intercepted. 
It's easy to see why Batista has been one of the most feared superstars in all of WWE. What do you have to do to overcome that fear and take down this big man, Corey? Simply put, Cole, be quick and be accurate. You're not going to take down a Redwood like Batista with one giant swing of your axe. You need to chip away until the animal falls. Counters. A oh, bear hug, squeezing the breath out of him. All right. Bear hug. Well placed elbow. We'll get you out of it. That might be enough. Yes, it is. Unbelievable athleticism. And just like that, we've kicked the tempo up a notch. Striking at will. An endless bombardment from the champion. The challenger has to be rocked. Shamrock looking to attack from above. Big time clothesline. Good grief. Ooh, treading all over their opponent. Vicious right forearm. just sent to the champion with that move. Planning on what to do next. Oh, right to the throat. Batista is feeding off the WWE Universe. Oh, not to the belly. He's heading up top. Thinking big. The effects of this match are showing on the champ. The animal's been grinding his teeth all night, and that was an indication that he's ready to feast now. And he sends him into the corner. Boom! What a right! Gosh! Good golly, Miss Molly! Gotta hurt. The champ put a lot of strain on their opponent's arm there. Inverted tree of low position now. <laughs> Ah, he's got that boot right up against oh, his face. Come on. Look, the most intelligent competitor in a battle knows that there are many roads to victory, including the low road. Not even a challenge. Oh, Shamrock locking in the ankle lock. Will his opponent tap out? Whoa, this is surprising, Byron. Yeah, I'm not really sure why he would let him out right there. Shamrock thinking. DDT planet. As the leg trap, fisherman suplex. He's heading to the floor, but he can't take his time. Uh oh. Batista able to counter. more than fired up right now. Batista getting the WWE Universe riled up. Oh my goodness. Ah, oh, what a smash. That is just insulting. Now that'll do some serious damage. He's testing fate here in danger of a count out. Back into the ring. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Batista with the with the Batista bite. The official asking him, is he gonna tap? Is he gonna tap out? He's trying. And he releases the hold. I don't think he had it fully locked in. Down to Odin and a double axe handle smash. Shoulder tackle. Pin attack for the championship.
We have a title change. Here is your winner and new Intercontinental Champion, the Animal Batista. And a new chapter in this title's legacy begins here. He had the championship mindset going into this match, and now he has the hardware to go along with it. This guy is the future. One half of the Creed Brothers. The following contest is a Tornado Tag Team Match. And is for the WWE Tag Team Championship. Introducing first, representing the Creed Brothers from Lexington, Ohio. Weighing in at 230 pounds, Julius Creed. Julius Creed is a straight-up unit. He went undefeated in collegiate conference competition. He's one of the best NXT Tag Champions ever. And now Julius is ready for all of WWE. And his partner, representing the Creed Brothers, from Sheryls, Ford, North Carolina, weighing in at 385 pounds. Strowman stomping to the ring with a mission on his mind. Yeah, once Braun gets rolling, he plows straight ahead, full steam ahead. Impressive physical ability. One of the biggest and baddest to ever step foot in WWE. Montez Ford is here, and he wants the smoke. And from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 232 pounds, Montez Ford! Some have said that the one thing holding Montez Ford back is his perceived inability to take things seriously, to seemingly turn everything into a joke. But when you're as athletic as he is, sometimes you can't help but be a little cocky. Uh, he's developed somewhat of a killer instinct lately and is ready to prove the doubters and naysayers Wrong. Unstoppable enthusiasm for competition. I cannot wait to see Tez compete. Byron, why can't you be this cool? I thought I was. Ah, the sixth time. Six That's time. That's enough, six. Saxton. We get it. I didn't get to finish, and boy. From Houston, Texas, weighing in at 251 pounds, Booker T. Thing of everything Booker T has earned. Countless titles, a crown, a scepter, and a Hall of Fame ring. Nothing left to prove, but still up for a good fight.
looking to make a statement tonight. Well, I'm going to take a page out of Booker T's book and say, all the suckers in the back better take note. Well, I feel cool when I say that. You win these, you make a case as one of the best teams ever. Big encounter here for the Tag Team Championships in this Tornado Tag Team match. A wild variation on the old classic and the insanity grows with Julius Creed and Strowman. And across the ring, the team they're ready to face off with, Montez Ford and Booker T. Was definitely not thinking about finesse with that one. Was only thinking about dominance. Oh, what a kick. Ooh. Big splash. Is it enough? He forces a break before the count of two. A little closer to getting the pinfall there, but this is still anybody's fight. Oh, oh, reversal catches Booker T. What a clothesline! Ouch! Here's a pin for the title. A kick out, and you can see the frustration starting to build. Those one counts getting harder and harder to kick out of. An arm wrench. DDT! Boom! Running FTO plants him. Nicely done. From the top. Diving double axe handle. The better part of Valor. Ah, jumpy DDT! My. Oof. A big forearm connects. Vicious right forearm. And Strowman couldn't get his hands on him to prevent that move. Even on the attack, Montez just has that swagger. And he's out of there in a nick of time. Right to the kidneys from behind. He takes control. The Scorpion Death Drop. Good night. Uh-oh. Go for the run. Strong counters from Strowman. Oh, the counter. Soul kick. Uh oh. About the ball. Rock bottom. Top row. Oh, with authority. Oh, saw it coming and got an elbow for their trouble. Plantsum. Nicely done. They're switching it right into a rope step. No other way to say it. Montez Ford wants the smoke. No! And Julius gets met with a response. Oh, what impact. The adrenaline is pumping, and the WWE Universe is on his side. Oh, what a choke slam. Toss them across the ring. And he has free reign to the outside with no countouts to worry about. Float over. Oh, into a DDT! Fight! Oh, what a suplex! Goes under the ropes to get back inside. to the defensive. All right, back to it. Returning to the ring. Answer that with a knee to the gut. Oh, there it is. Oh, down. Championship on the line. Well, the ref doesn't even see the cover. Valuable seconds passing as they're distracted. 
You have to respect these men for taking it to the next level. This one's becoming too close to call. Yeah, it's hard to predict how this one will end. Oh, look out. Ooh, he retaliates. Into an exploder. Into the corner. This can't be good. Big splash in the corner. What a reversal by Booker. Ooh, that might have just broken something. I don't... Oh, no. Getting in position. What's he planning to do here? Putting the pressure on now. I'm going to tap out here, but it ain't going to matter. Oh, man, that was a thing of beauty. Ready to a snapmare. Oh, just deadlifting their opponent and tossing them aside. He's in a little bit of trouble now. Don't do it. Man, it's like a heat-seeking missile coming at you. And the explosion occurring ringside. Oh, a neck breaker. Tough position to be caught in here. Oh, ooh. Frying their opponent's arm out. Oh, my goodness. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Oh, man. Booker T is feeling it now. Wheels are turning in Booker's head. Booker T again. Well, that clinch things for Booker. Pen attempt for the championship. Here are your winners and new WWE Tag Team Champions, the team of Montez Ford and Booker T. Tag Team Chemistry in full effect with these two superstars. These men really rose to the unique challenge of a Tornado Tag Match. The Enforcer, Solo Sokoa. The following contest is a no-holds-barred match. Making his way to the ring, representing the Bloodline. From Las Vegas, Nevada, weighing in at 250 pounds, Solo Sokoa. The younger brother of the Usos, but had a far different upbringing. When Jimmy and Jay were getting their start in WWE, Solo was still getting into fights on the street. I do not envy this competitor at all. This superstar is going to have to contend with the unmatched striking and power of The Undertaker. Here comes Hell on Wheels. No introduction needed. And his opponent from Death Valley weighing in at 305 pounds. The Undertaker. A metamorphosis of destruction is on display. He may not dress like Satan himself anymore, but he's still down with the devil and ready to get medieval tonight.
Does this man have the answer for the unrestrained aggression that comes when facing Solo Sokoa? for the most hostile of rivalries. Rage has clouded their vision, and now they're only focused on unadulterated devastation. Let's hope the local medical facility is prepared for the aftermath of this match. Undertaker moves just in time. There he goes, right into the corner. Here's the cover. cover. And he breaks the count quickly. Close call, but not enough yet. Whoa, stiff headbutt. And now I see some blood on the Undertaker's face. And Sinkoa gets warded off. In a no-disqualification match, you never want to be the superstar on the wrong end of a chair or a kendo stick or whatever else might be hiding under the ring. You want to be the one inflicting that punishment because that's how you control the pace and the match as a whole. Absolutely no telling what's underneath the ring tonight. That show is going to cause extreme amounts of damage. Momentum clearly on the side of Sakoa. Solo is stifling the opposition now. Solo reverses and looks to capitalize. There is some power behind that punch. Just a ruthless streak for the world to see. It goes without saying that. There is a certain disdain for your opponent when you pull off something like that. Come on! That's a bit much. He had it scouted. And that could be a first step towards The Undertaker gaining control. Yeah, the dead man getting some refreshed vitality. Smart strategy, attack the knee. And around, uh oh, what a power slam! Uh oh, carefully measured down with the leg drop. What a counter! Look at this going right after the left arm. Gotta hurt, not a whole lot you can do with a bum wing, guys. Clubbing blow to the back. Takes a shot to the back. Oof. Oof. Slows that down with a well-placed kick. Dangerous spot for him to be in. Rips applied. Super. And he goes for the pin. He gets the shoulder up in two. Somehow, some way. Beating down with a shoulder. Straight pummeling them with it. And he said, you're not getting me with that this time. Every successive move is putting their opponent in a dicey situation. I don't care who you are. You can't take consecutive attacks like rearing way back. Some in spike. Sakoa might have just right finished things. What? Only two? The dead man still very much alive, despite taking what I can only describe as a hellacious maneuver. From the top, all the way to the outside. What a reckless attack. Off the top rope, putting it all on the line. Oh, boy. And in WWE, you won't end up in the penalty box for high sticking. All right, here we go. In front of DDT. Lights out. Ah, oh, look at this. Just cranking it out. Just cranking ahead.
Good golly, what a knee. This match is brutality starting to show on him. Taker bringing forth another unholy attack there. Oh, that hurt. Oh, weakening the leg here. The Undertaker. Uh-oh. Swinging the elbow to halt the offense. Oh, colliding with a barricade. No love lost between these superstars right now. Really trying to prove who the better man truly is. And Sokoa on the receiving end again. Sokoa needs to better assess the situation to turn this around. Hits the spinning solo. Solo with an emphatic statement there. The street champ is in the building, and he's not backing down. And now with him going for the table, we're just in straight up appetite for destruction territory here. Whoa, stiff headbutt. He's rummaging for some sort of equalizer underneath the ring. Grabbing a kendo stick. Any connection with flesh will definitely leave a welt. And he gets set back into the ring. No telling what's underneath the ring tonight. I guess he thinks the one thing missing in this match is a steal. Uh-oh, winding up. Oh, it's Spike. This could put a stop to the Undertaker. He kicked out at two. Amazing kick out from the Undertaker. His resilience tonight is unreal. It is unreal that this match is still going on. I don't know that would end most matches. What a match this has been. What a fight. We are all glad to be witnessing such an extraordinary match tonight. Heads out of the ring. What's next? Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Oh. Holy cow. That's your commit on the the kick. Close line takes him down. Forget about it. So precise with the super kick. All eyes are on Solo now. Ouch! Able to sidestep it. DDT by the Undertaker. Everyone is on their feet in this building. Absolutely showing the respect for all the exertion these athletes are putting each other through. Taking out the knee. A series of disabling maneuvers from Undertaker. Toss back into the ring. Oh, great. Rearranging our ringside furniture here. Clearing the announce desk. What a mess. Undertaker headed top row. Boom, running ST. Here's the cover for the win. I am in shock. What's it going to take to keep this guy down? Big drop of the leg. Oh, jarring back elbow. He's got the Undertaker dead to rights, and it looks like the gunslinger's out of him. Rearing way back. There's a Samoan spike. Ouch. Cut. That one has to end this. And all the bloodshed, perhaps worth it now. Here is your winner, Solo Sikoa. 
Undertaker somehow suffered a loss here. I wasn't sure Big Evil could be stopped. Every dog has their day. You better believe Undertaker won't let this happen again. The phenomenal one is here. AJ Styles is no stranger to stealing the show, no matter the circumstance. The following contest is a fatal four-way extreme rules match and is for the World Heavyweight Championship! Making his way to the ring, representing the OC from Gainesville, Georgia, weighing in at 218 pounds, the World Tag Team Champion, the phenomenal AJ Styles! I think it's appropriate to say things are getting just Sweet. One of the very best to lace up a pair of boots. Plenty of titles and main event wins here in WWE. Yeah, he's known as the face that runs the place for a reason. The voice of the voiceless has returned. Forget the night of Punk's historic return. But now, Punk must prove himself. Says he's now home, but many competitors have said this is no longer his home. Punk has never been more focused. He's now down to business, and he wants to rewrite his legacy and write a whole new chapter in the WWE. Punk possesses a lethal combination of fighting styles, and he's going to need it tonight. Yeah, no doubt about it. Punk is always ready for a fight, and he proclaims he is the measuring stick until someone proves him otherwise. Simply the greatest of all time, John Cena. And from West Newberry, Massachusetts, weighing in at 251 pounds, the greatest of all time, John Cena. There is perhaps no superstar in WWE history more decorated than John Cena. WrestleMania main events, Royal Rumble wins, Mr. Money in the Bank, the list goes on. And he's showing no signs of slowing down. Cena thrives on the pressure. He thrives on the crowd reaction. There's a reason he's known as Big Match John. Matches like tonight are exactly where he excels.
The lights have gone out, heralding the arrival of Bray Wyatt. It's really hard to know what to make of Wyatt. There's a darkness at work here. A darkness that has swallowed Bray Wyatt whole. The time is almost at hand. Bray Wyatt is about to deliver a reckoning. A fully confident challenger in their quarter. Absolutely hell-bent on capturing the title. A clash for the title here in this elimination contest, and we're in for a good one with AJ Styles, CM Punk, John Cena, and Bray Wyatt dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Ooh, sharp elbow. And that definitely made solid impact. Massive damage to the whole body. Oh, he knew what was coming. Oh my gosh, what impact. Illegal in many sports, but that was used effectively in there. Put in a position now. Oh, snake eyes caving in their face. Oh, what a counter. Turns that back on CM Punk. No disqualifications has to benefit a certain type of superstar more than others, doesn't it, Corey? Get off your high horse, Cole. And no disqualifications match benefits the superstar who's smarter, faster, and better. Using the rules to your advantage doesn't make you the villain here. And that can end up putting CM Punk on shaky legs for a bit. Yeah, that's why it's already hard to work melding the mind game with physical attacks. Elbow drop. The piercing. Well, that is a sign that definitely gets the point across. In the corner he goes, a perfectly placed target. And he heads out of the ring, no count outs, no worries. And got away with that one. That was just wrong. You should be a better person than that. He can do it here. And he manages to kick out at one. I think this match still has a ways to go. Say good night, sleeper hold is applied. I mean, how do you get it? Is it enough here? Shoulder up and the referee ends the count. Showing his determination there with that kick out. Cena with a reversal. Suplex. And 
sent right into the corner. Ooh, what a calf kick. Body slam slipped out. Did not look good for AJ, and yeah, he's busted open now. Crashing down like that, having the wind knocked out of you. Can he score the pin? He's able to kick out before two. This isn't even close to over. Well, they say everyone has a plan until they get punched in the mouth. Well, someone just threw their plan out the window. Section. Looks like John Cena is locked in on his opponent. He's one step ahead there. Oh, it could be nap time. We know John Cena never. Sleeper hole is cinched in. We've seen epic battles 
Before this is it. He stops the count, but then to Punk. Punk hoisting up his opponent, looking to finish him here. Good night, GTS. That could end Cena right now. Oh, a tough elimination for John Cena. That had to sting. And that was a successful bit of offense with that maneuver. Oh my God, no, that's too far. Setting up for something here. Lands face first. And that mysterious seemingly unlimited reserve of power just evidence could do it. It only gets a one count. Giving a massive effort to overcome the pin attempt. Oh! Uh oh, Ryan for the speed. Styles gets out of the way. He just bit AJ Styles setting him up. Styles clash. Has AJ delivered the exclamation? Two count. What a kick out at two. Unbelievable. I thought Punk was done for sure. Never underestimate the resiliency of the second city saint. And AJ used what has put so many men away in the past, but to no avail. Bray Wyatt on the... Uh-oh. Knees up, got the knees up at the last second. Russian leg sweep. Oh, big thud coming from the steel trap. with zero regard for anyone's safety. Oh, just inflicting so much damage to the body. And a counter, a counter by Styles. It's locked in, and the calf crusher, will he tag? Oh, Bray Wyatt, he has nowhere to go. Is this the end for Bray Wyatt? And he lets him out of the submission hold. Could have been a strategic move to wear down that body part for something bigger later. AJ Styles looking to end this right here, right now! What a Styles clash! Did AJ get all of it? Cover! There's two! Elimination and is brand 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 comes to an end. Backbreaker, face first, lethal combination. Saw coming and got out of there. He's going for the pin. This could be it. Oh. Yeah, no. He doesn't get the three. He just won't give up. Oh. Just punched him right in the middle. Oh. 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 already. Set him up here. Up in the suplex. Oh, no. Neckbreaker. He's going for it all. From the top. Oh, 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 drop. oh it's a piercing elbow. Styles looks to be in control here. AJ's really turning it up now. He switches it back around. Springboard. Springboard. Oh. Close line. And he's taking this to the outside now. 
I think we're about to turn this place into a honky tonk. Climbs back inside. Quick back elbow. Detours that up. Hug looking for GTS. Go sweet. This could put a stop to AJ. to outlast every other superstar in this match. Defying the odds, accomplishing the seemingly impossible, that's what elimination matches are all about.